All right, King, it's time to shut down this hellhole. Are you ready? Sure thing. Let's do this. What was that? Doesn't sound like anything good. Get everyone over to Kinsey's. We gotta move fast. Beats dancing. to the briefing, am I? We haven't started yet. I'm waiting on Miller. I still feel bad about punching Matt in the face. He'll get over it. Or he'll kill me in my sleep. That's always a possibility, too. Got what we got, guys. Can we just get to murdering already? We got a problem. Now we're talking. What's up? The Zin are coming. Here? That's probably why he said it's a problem. All right, let's take cover. We should be able to ambush them. Not so sure about that. to kill these bastards. How the fuck did they find your... Sanctum. I don't know. Who cares? Let's just kill them. Hey, we gotta go. There's too many of them. There's a helicopter on a nearby roof. We can use it to get everyone to safety. All right, everyone, let's stick together. Matt and I will head out on our own. We what? Take care of your people. We'll catch up. Whatever. Before we do anything, we need some breathing room. Let's take out those tanks. You are all in the sky. Why are we running? I'm down for some murder. If we lose the heat, we can get back to the plan. Whatever the plan was, it went out the fucking window. We need to focus on surviving. Pierce and I will hold him here. Just get everyone else to safety, player. We got this! on it. safe place yet? Okay, um, hold on, I'm scanning. Scan fast. UFO! Yo, 
these in have some high-tech shit. What's their awesome like? Oh, these in have all kinds of cool stuff. I wish I could get into their armory and see what they're prototyping. They even have murder bots. Murder bots? Now that's my kind of household appliance. Enemy ship flying in. Pearson Ben to go. We're not going to my place. Walked away, right? Oh, look, a cat. Is this a pet store? Johnny, you're about to meet your spirit animal. Super. Bloody climax. Who names this shit? Where to now? Doesn't matter. The Zin just found us. Kinsey, get us out of here. On it. Ooh, is that a killing floor? Merry Christmas to me. What do you mean, uh-oh? Boss, the game is on. It started by itself. I can't shut it down. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to a very special episode of Professor Genki's Super Ethical Reality Climax. Bring on the man cat. The floor is active and the doors are locked. Nobody gets out. Including us. Until that is, the contestants rack up enough points to fill the murdometer. Shit, I'm down. Let's do this! At least give me a challenge. Look at all the contestants today! And all new targets as well. The Zen Empire have taken it upon themselves to face the challengers. Truly, a bold move on their part. You're not kidding. The Zen are the fiercest opponents in the universe, Bobby. They should be a tough fight for the Saints. Yes, indeed. <laughs> Then are falling before the might of these contestants. They sure are. Look at how they're mowing down the opposition. Goes to show you how much having a team behind you can really come in handy. <laughs> I wish we had a team behind us. What we have is the love and support of Zinyak. What else could we possibly need? <laughs> Nothing at all, Bobby. Nothing at all. Bobby, 
enter the arena. It's always a special occasion when the professor takes the stage. Let's watch the master at work. That's Genki, huh? Yeah, he looks crazy. That fucking cat isn't walking out of here alive. Boss, he's kind of helping us. Not walking out of here alive. Good shot by the contestant. Genki's sure gonna feel that one. It takes a particularly skilled player to take on Professor Genki. Especially after facing the considerable might of the Zen Empire. Of which we are required to extol the virtues. <laughs> and there you have it, folks. Genki is down. Down, but never out, Zack. So true, Bobby. So true. Is that all? Looks like it. Oh my gosh. Kenzie? Let's get to the prize room. That was fun. They got more games like this in Steelport? So where to? You know, I generally don't like getting involved in these things, but this is really exciting. Welcome to the wacky world of murder. What do we do next? Ben's plan was to overload the simulation. We can still do that, but not if the Zen know our every move. You can make us stealthy again, right? Yes, but I need to get back to the ship so I can find a way to cut them off. Once that's done, it's just a matter of finding the weakest point in the simulation. Okay then, let's head home. intentional. Hey, player. Pierce and I are pulling out of the simulation. Meet you back on the ship. I was talking to King earlier and that conversation cut out too. Any idea what's causing that? sleeping so we get picked up by Zinyak. Too bad for them we're awake. What's the plan? I'm gonna check on Kinsey. You're gonna secure the doors. Kinsey, we're not leaving you behind. You ready? Cause we got visitors. Decks. We have to hold the room! Fuck that! I'm not waiting for them to come to me! Let's get to the bridge. Shit, are we driving into the sun? Okay, let's... 
let's check some computer thing. No need. I have already analyzed our situation. Shit, I forgot Mr. Deix Ex Machina was even on the ship. A Zin transport has attached itself and is dragging us toward what I assume is certain doom. So how do we stop the certain doom part? If I were you, I would deal with the strange heat signature by the cargo bay first. Cargo bay? Fuck. Let's go! Good girls kick ass. Shondi! Is Kinsey okay? Everyone's fine. The Zin grabbed me and... Hey, Sid said something about heat signatures? One of them put a device on the wall. I'm not sure what it is. We got bombs over here. Bombs? Yeah, and they're set to blow. You thinking what I'm thinking? No hacking, no stealth, just explosions. You got a specific thing you want to blow up, or just shit in general? Kinsey, what's the weakest point on the Zin ship? Yo, boss, Kinsey's... Fuck! I... Look, we'll just find the biggest, glowingest thing on the ship and stick the bombs to that. These Zin sure do make a good argument for murdering him. When I'm through with Zinhak, he's gonna be begging for me to kill him. Take your time, huh? That sounds like a plan. I get the chance? I'm gonna rip Zinhak's goddamn head off. But where do you think the Zin had Kinsey? I don't know, but when I find Matt and Asha, I'm gonna beat that information out of them. Still think I'm just a pretty face? Good one. Yo, we got some alien gun over here. Hell of a welcome back, huh, Johnny? Fuck, you were thinking I wanted to go to Hawaii or something? I live for this shit. important. Let's blow this up. What the fuck was that? Yo, these bombs are hotter than we thought. Let's get the fuck out of here. The Saints rule even here. around to get in here. Wasn't a bad fuck you to Zinyak. 
Let's get out of here and find Kinsey. God damn it! What happened? MI6 fucked us. I knew it! Asha had it out for me since jump! She talked shit in Pakistan, she sucker punched me I can't believe Miller had me fooled. To think I actually apologized. He's probably been working this angle for a while. Hell, he might have even been the one who tipped off Zinyak about Johnny. Doubt it. Dante said that the lowest circle of hell was reserved for betrayers. But it's important to remember that it's the storyteller who decides who the hero is, not morality. But while philosophers will spend years debating the ethics of the Kinsey Gambit, the Saints had a less charitable view. Keith David is a dead man. 